Canine flu has shut down the Animal Humane Society. Tonight, operations are on hold at a number of facilities, meaning no one can drop off or adopt animals for about a month. Fox 9's Tim Blotz joins us with more on this very rare virus here in Minnesota, Tim. Yeah, in fact, Randy, other states, in canine flu is very common, and they vaccinate for it. We do not hear because Minnesota dogs generally do not get it until now. A dog was brought in with connections to an out-of-state shelter that initially that dog did test positive for canine flu. Um, did not test positive, I should say, but by the time 200 other dogs started showing respiratory symptoms. So out of an abundance of caution, the three adoption centers in Golden Valley, Woodbury and Coon Rapids will close for about three to four weeks. And that means no animals will be taken in or adopted out. Dr. Sarah Lewis says this is highly contagious. And unfortunately, like all viruses, there's really no treatment. So it is a virus and it does have to just kind of run its course. Um, the virus itself looks like in an animal, kind of that typical upper respiratory, like when we have a cold. Um, you know, we have nasal discharge, sometimes we have ocular discharge, uh, we're coughing, sneezing, we feel pretty crummy. Um, the dogs are experiencing that very same thing. Now, in addition to closing, the Animal Humane Society will contact those families who adopted dogs since March 23rd, which is about 175 families. The staff will instruct them on how to treat their dogs and give medication if necessary. The dogs impacted should recover, but there could be a few that struggle to develop and uh, actually struggle and develop pneumonia. So you'll want to keep an eye on them. Now, Dr. Lewis says the flu spreads very rapidly where dogs are housed together in tight quarters, but the risk of your dog catching canine flu at the dog park or out on your walk is very, very low. She says it's just not common here in Minnesota. And in this case, apparently brought in again by a dog who was exposed at another shelter out of state. So no evidence of this virus spreading to humans as well. Bottom line is no adoptions or drop-offs at the Animal Humane Society for at least another three to four weeks. Randy? All right. We will heed the warning. There right. you go.